Hey Bro Chicas, welcome back to my channel and for today's video I have a super random Walmart haul for you. <laughs> I went to Walmart today with like a couple of random things that I needed and then I got a couple of other random things. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get into it. Okay, this is <laughs> the first thing that I uh, picked up. So this is a pool, obviously. It is the Deluxe Comfort Pool by Play Day. And it is a four seater. It's got like chairs and it has two cup holders here and over here. So this is eight foot, nine inches wide. Um, just something to sit in to keep cool because this weekend is gonna be in the 90s. And last weekend it was in the 80s and I wanted to cool off and we didn't have anything. You know, it's different where we live now. We don't have the community pool anymore. So I wanted to definitely go ahead and get a little pool for the backyard. I don't know if I'm going to put this in the grass or on the deck yet. That I'm not sure of. But either way, just something that we could sit in to cool off. We don't need to like swim. But this is like a big box. This is a big box. This was $54. Um, so a little bit more pricey because I know like the one that I got a couple years ago from Walmart, the same brand, was a 10 foot like rectangle family size pool and that was $29.99. So this is a little bit pricier but I do love that it has the cup holders and how it has seats because sometimes I don't want to be like all the way in the water. I just want to be like sitting in it a little bit just to feel like cooling off you know I don't need to be fully submerged sometimes so anyways this I thought was a really cool blow up pool I also got some gum I got two packs of gum one for hubby and one for me this is my favorite it's the icebreakers ice cubes with uh the peppermint flavor and I got this because I quit smoking it's been 13 days and it's been really really rough so I had to get some chewing gum. Like I had to get something, you know, for that oral fixation. Also super random, but I needed a rug for around the toilet downstairs in the bathroom because um, I've never experienced this before or maybe I don't remember, but like when it's really hot, the toilet has condensation on it because the water inside is so cold and the it's been very humid and hot. So now that we have an air conditioning down here, maybe it won't happen so much. But anyways, it was dripping water and then it would like run on the tiles because it was just dripping condensation from the back part. And then, yeah, so I wanted to get a little rug for around the toilet. Uh, this was actually, it said it was $16 by the brand Better Homes and Gardens, but on the shelf it said $10. So what I did was I took a picture of it and I showed it to the lady at the register and all she did was change it to $10 for me, which is really awesome because this is a nice quality one. Like this one is really, really nice and soft. So I don't know why I was marked wrong, but... They're lost because I got it for 10 bucks instead of 16. So don't be afraid. If you go to Walmart, do not be afraid to ask them to correct the price. If you see that they have stocked a whole shelf of something and it says that price and then you go and you check on the app or it comes up on the register more expensive, don't be afraid to tell them, hey, um, on the shelf it actually said this. Can you correct that? Because that's false advertising. I always do that at Walmart and they always respect it. Another thing I picked up was this Olay Hyaluronic Acid Nourishing and Hydrating Body Lotion. I already have used this. I'm actually almost done with my bottle, so I wanted to get another one. This has got to be my favorite body lotion right now. It just feels so hydrating and it smells so good. Every time I put this on, I just feel like so clean. Like after the shower, I'll lotion my whole body with this and you just smell so fresh and so clean. And the, the smell lingers with you, which I absolutely love. I know scented like fragrances and stuff on your skin is not supposed to be like healthy, but I just love it. It smells so good and it's so hydrating. So it's a little pricey. It's like $9 for this lotion and you get 17 fluid ounces, but I really, really like it. If you've tried it and you love it, let me know. Um, if you're looking for a hydrating body lotion, 
try this one. Next thing I got was another bra. I finally got another one. I've been meaning to get another one in a different color ever since I got the first bra, but took me a little while, but here I am, I got it. So uh, I got the ex extra large plus, and this is the Hanes Signature Smooth Comfort uh, with Smooth Tech Band Bra. It has four-way stretch, it's wire-free, and sleek and smooth support, and it stays put all day. I'm wearing this exact bra in nude right now. It has no cups and it has no underwire. I just wanted to go ahead and get a black one. So it is so comfortable. I love how it has a V-neck, you guys. Here's the fit of it. And I've talked about this bra before in a vlog, if you didn't catch that, but this is the most comfortable bra ever. It doesn't have adjustable straps. They're just like very stretchy straps. And oh, I just love this bra so much. I hate wearing underwire now. I hate wearing things with like thick cups and underwire. They're so uncomfortable and I can't wait to take them off. This one feels like, I don't even know how to describe it. Like, it's like, you know how brief underwear are so ugly, like they look like granny panties, but they're so comfortable because they're full coverage. This is like the brief underwear of bras, if that makes any sense. Yes, it looks ugly. Yes, it definitely looks like a grandma bra. Go into Walmart and put this on and tell me that it's not the best bra you've ever had on your body. And it doesn't give you like ugly uniboob and it actually has a really nice natural shape and it actually like, I think it keeps them up. Like I don't think I have saggy boobs or anything. Like just go try this on. It's literally 15 bucks and you won't be disappointed. The next thing I got was another t-shirt. I wanted to get another one of these before they sold out. It's actually the same exact shirt as this one, this is also from Walmart. It has the Rolling Stones on it and it's a size extra large. I absolutely love this t-shirt. I'm so obsessed with it. It goes so well with these super light colored denim jeans and I just love all of the colors. It's so easy to throw on with jeans and you just look put together. I don't know why, but I just feel put together when I just have this nice shirt and a pair of jeans your makeup done, your hair done, a couple of accessories, and you're good. So I figured I would pick up another one. Now, I don't really listen to the Beatles like that. I do know a lot of songs by the Beatles, but I don't really listen to the Beatles like on a daily basis. But oh well, because you know what? The print of this is super pretty, <laughs> and at least I know what the band is. Unlike some people who will be wearing band t-shirts and they have never even heard a song by the band that I cannot stand. I cannot stand that. But anyways, um, I loved the greenish, blue, purple colors that we had going on here. And it is like a dark gray shirt. And I was going to get the blondie one because they do have a graphic tee with blondie on it, but they didn't have my size. So I really do like to get the uh, extra large. I did try on a large and it just didn't fit right. I like the way the extra large fits. So this was $9.98. It does say it's by the brand Time and True, but these graphic tees are so soft and such a relaxed fit. I just love how they fit. So I wanted to go ahead and get another one. This is a nice fun color for spring and summer. Last couple of things I got were makeup products. I just really, like I went to Walmart today, kind of in a cranky mood, just kind of you guys will see in the vlog, just like super cranky today because, you know, quitting smoking cigarettes is really, really hard. And I was trying to distract myself and treat myself. So I bought makeup that I didn't necessarily need, but I wanted. I was just trying to treat myself. So I wanted to find the L'Oreal Age Perfect Tinted Balm. They did not have it. Like there wasn't even a display. It's not like they were out of stock. It's just that there wasn't even the display. They just didn't have it in my Walmart. So I'll have to search for that another time. But the other one I did want to try as well from L'Oreal was the True Match Nude Hyaluronic Tinted Serum. I have heard good things about this one as well. Sorry, it's looking kind of blurry, but it has 1% pure hyaluronic acid in it. If you don't know what hyaluronic acid is, 
It is a very hydrating liquid or serum, super, super hydrating. And this is the shade Medium 4 5. So I'm really excited to test this out. I hope the color is okay. I usually go with Medium because I'm going to keep getting tan outside. So I didn't want to go with anything too fair. But this is supposed to be like a super light, light coverage. And it's just really supposed to be like a skin perfecter and it's supposed to be skincare and makeup all in one. So it's not like you're going to get a ton of coverage from this. It's more so like a your skin but better and glowy. That's the effect it's supposed to have. Right now I'm wearing the Wet n Wild Tinted Hydrator and I absolutely love the way that it looks on my skin. It also is very light coverage and I've just been digging the less is more type of makeup. <laughs> I've been doing that, I want, to say, I want to say for like the past year with makeup, it's just less is more with me. Like that's, I want to enhance my features. I don't want to just cake it on anymore. So I'm super excited to try this. Um, I will either try it in a vlog or I will do a, de a dedicated video. I'm not sure. Let me know what you want me to do in the comments. And the last thing I picked up was like on an end cap display. They usually put new makeup on the end caps. And I saw this and I thought it was really interesting. So this is by Neutrogena. I never buy Neutrogena makeup, but this is a micro brow tint serum pen, nourishing brow. Um, so I got it in this shade medium brown and basically you it's a pen that you just take and make hair like strokes and it's just going to look like microblading which is perfect for me because my eyebrows actually are microbladed so um, there actually is little hair like lines all through my brows. So it just makes sense to fill in my brows more with something like this, especially because I'm going for more of a natural look. I used to completely block fill my eyebrows and ugh, I could not even stand that now. I do not want any part of that. <laughs> it's so ugly. I don't even like the eyebrows. I don't even like the way that I've been doing them lately. So I'm very interested in this pen. It's let's see if I can show you. So that's how fine it is. It looks like a calligraphy pen. Let's see. Oh my God. That really is. Wow. That really is hair like. So I'm super excited to test this out. It's going to be super natural vibe. And I'm all about the natural vibes <laughs> these days. So I just, I wanted to try it. This was like 12 bucks though. A little bit pricey. And this guy right here was like 15 bucks. Definitely pricey, but I think they're going to be really good and promising. So that was it for my Walmart haul. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Super random, but let me know down below if you guys enjoy the random hauls. Um, give it a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe to my channel if you love shopping. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.